Okay, we have arrived at Chorley. So we are staying in the Premier Inn tonight. And we're having a night here. And there's a pub just next to it called the Malt House Farm, which looks quite nice. It's a little bit like an hotel, that. Okay, so we're on the ground floor, right near the restaurant where they will be checking out. Thank you, Lewis. Than I thought that. <laughs> okay, so we're in room 22 in this Premier Inn. So obviously, it's a family room. So we've got a double bed and two singles. And it's just usual fare in here, as is usual. Got a fan, which is unusual. You don't always get a fan. Because they do out complain that it gets to get warm in these Premier Inn, so it's really cool in here actually. Got some towels, got some tea and coffee making facilities, so you can make yourself a drink. And, um, got a TV. It's not switched on, obviously. And then if we pan around, got. The lads. All right, so then you've got your bathroom, which is just, it's your usual really. It has a bath, it actually has a bath. Shower, I'll show you that look. So, here's your shower. So there's the shower. So yeah, that's Premier Inn. Surely, tomorrow we'll go for breakfast at the pub, which we've paid £20 for, for buffet breakfast for the four of us. So I'll show you the menu for the breakfast. So it's obviously, it's unlimited. Um, we've paid £20 for the four of us, kids, obviously kids eat free, and it's ten ninety nine on here. Uh, so we've got eggs, scrambled, fried, poached, boiled, hash browns, fat bacon, Sausages, fake bacon, vegan sausages, baked beans, black pudding, grilled tomato, mushrooms. Then you've got loads of stuff from the, if you can see it, from the bakery. And actually pretty decent. It was last time we had Premier Inn breakfast, so. And that will fill us up nicely, so we can continue our journey to Glasgow Airport. So yeah, this uh, breakfast area is slightly different to the other ones. It's not actually in the pub, it's actually in the Premier Inn itself. Well, sometimes you do go to the pub and have it. But it's only a small room, quite quaint. And then you've got your breakfast and cereals over here. Have to get some orange juice, probably. Put your croissants. No, coffee machine. Is it going through this time? Yeah. Toast. Yeah, yeah. Got some butter. Yes. Good, good. A big breakfast guys it looks a bit like well loaded onto my plate as you can see but I need a big breakfast this morning it's got to try and last me most of the day Jasmine's got some pastries right so that draws us to a close here for one night I had a really nice breakfast staff are absolutely amazing lovely staff I'll have a quick look at the Maltas farm.
area. Now, apparently, there are rooms on this side as well. Yes, yeah, so he could be in this block here, which is backs onto the pub. It's actually quite nice. Yeah, I think all these rooms shall go all the way around. And then this is the, the pub. We didn't actually get a chance to go in the pub into the malt house, which was a shame. But we did arrive quite late and we were quite tired. So, but nice looking little pub. And apparently this leads onto the canal. Yeah, a little area. The canal's there, look. <coughs> and here is the canal. And you can obviously put there's a tow path, there's a path on the opposite side of the canal which can walk all the way along. So yeah, we'll definitely have to revisit this place. We'll try and come up here one day if we can get a cheap deal. But yeah. Very impressed. So the pub looks really nice. And um definitely recommend it. So yeah, if you're thinking about stopping at the Premier Inn in Chorley, I would definitely recommend it. It's, uh, it's been really good actually. And uh, I'll tell you how much it cost us. It cost us £40 to stay here. We got a, a deal on. Um, family of four for family room, £40 for the night. And we paid an extra £20 for the buffet breakfast, which was an all-you-can-eat breakfast. So yeah, that only costs £40, uh, plus the 20 so £60 in total, including breakfast. And like I say, it's a pretty nice uh, Premier Inn, it's, it's, the reception is absolutely wonderful. I'm not saying it's always like that, but that's been our experience anyway. Alright, onwards now. Onwards, upwards and forwards.